Hello, Columbia. Welcome to our edition of Telling Our Story, Exploring the Parks. I am your host, Wanda Austin Herndon. Join us as we explore our parks. Hello, Columbia, and welcome to Woodland Park. I am your host, Wanda Austin Herndon, and welcome to Telling Our Story. Today, we are walking through Woodland Park. So, take a moment and come take a walk with us. Located at 6500 Old Knight Parkway, Woodland Park has tennis courts, picnic tables, a baseball diamond, and a playground area, as well as a community center. Their playground equipment is all new. This is a very neat play structure with a lot of different climbing activities. The grassy area has plenty of shade, including the swings, which are separate from the rest of the play structure. Water and restrooms are available in the community center, as well as the gymnasium. The community center has internet access for the public to utilize. Um, we have an authorized exercise class that, that's on Monday, Wednesdays, and Fridays from 10 until 11 a.m. I've been coming here ever since Gerard has been our instructor. It is a very uh, informative class, and we also recognize after a time doing the exercises that our muscles and our bones and everything are, are reacting a bit better. And especially for our senior citizens, we are getting older. Therefore, we need to exercise more, not only here, but other places as well. The operational hours for the community center is Monday through Thursday, 2 p.m. to 9 p.m. Friday 2 p.m. to 8 p.m., Saturday 10 a.m. to 6 p.m., and Sundays 2 p.m. to 7 p.m. Operational hours do change during the season, so please contact the park for regular operation hours. Well, yeah, we have an after-school camp um, that we had for, for, for quite some years. Um, and it's really convenient for our parents that the school is right next door to us, Meadowfield Elementary School, and we try to, you know, engage them in things like, you know, doing their homework and uh, activities in the gym, you know, on the playground. So a little bit of everything for them when they're here for that little bit of time. Woolen Park is also one of four city locations that include a public art dedication. This park's mural features Sarah Mae Fleming titled The Pursuit of Justice. The mural stories the history on June 22, 1954. 20-year-old Sarah Fleming boarded a public bus. Fleming sat down in the seat near the white-only section and the bus driver ordered Fleming to leave. On July 14, 1955, the U.S. Fourth Circuit Court of Appeals ruled segregation of public buses unconstitutional. Fleming's historic action desegregated Columbia City buses. Her case also helped support the Montgomery bus boycott following Rosa Parks' arrest. So we welcome any, any one of our patrons that want to come in and, and use our park and, and enjoy it, enjoy it. That's, that's what we're here for. Thank you for joining us for this episode of Telling Our Story. Please join us again. As with all our parks, our mission here at the City of Columbia Parks and Recreation is to change lives through a culture of transformational leadership, innovation, and phenomenal customer service. Thank you for joining us today, and please, Join us in the future for more episodes of Telling Our Story, Exploring the Parks. And remember, we are Columbians.